I'm Kinley Ray Curtis. I'm seven years old. We are down in West Texas hunting with my family and we are hunting big mule deer bucks. What did you think of that road on the way in here yesterday? Very bumpy. You ready to shoot a big buck? Yes. It smells like poop, like dog poop. Oh really? They're terrible. They're probably over there pooping their brains out. Come smell. Okay. Oh yeah. On our first morning in West Texas, it was cold and beautiful. The High West Outfitter team on this hunt consisted of Jim Breck Bean and Jasper Klein. As we traveled around Glasson, Jim Breck looks up into this draw and sees a big group of deer. Upon closer inspection, we can see there is 100% for sure a call buck in the group. There is a zero tolerance policy on this ranch for bad genes. Kinley and Jim Breck are all set up and about to push delete on some bad genetics. There it goes. That deer. I think I smoked That's a deer. bonus buck. You did smoke a deer. Big old bonus buck too. Yeah, you don't look like him. No, he's a cold deer. Hey, first team buck, huh, Kenny? Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> All Which, right. That is a fantastic start to the first morning. With the deer processed and a short power nap, we are headed back out for the evening hunt. On our first evening, we saw some beautiful country looked over a lot of deer, and right at last light, we saw a great buck walking up the draw, and we were on the fence, and I think everybody decided he just needs one more year. Although he's a fantastic buck, we're gonna let him slide tonight. Look, I'm having a baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's a boy. <laughs> no, don't show your food, dude. On the morning of day two, we just enjoyed God's artwork. The weather was cool, crisp, and seemed to be completely void of deer. I know I'm not alone when I say this, but sometimes those slow hunts are just the reminders we need to stop and enjoy it all while we're here. The deer hunting may get us here, but the family time and being around friends in the great outdoors is what keeps us coming back. At lunchtime on day two, I said, Kinley, would you do an interview with me? And she said, sure. And this is what I got. Is this gonna be your first mule deer buck? Yes. You excited? Yes. Show me with your hands how big he's gonna be. Ooh, that's a good one. How many points? 10. <laughs> 10, good. Awesome. Have you hunted before? Yes. What have you hunted? Ostrich. Jacob's four horn in a white tail. Awesome. And soon to be big old mule deer buck. And a javelina. Yep. And whatever else gets in the way of your barrel. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Who are your hunting partners over here? So, okay, so introduce your friends. This is Ace and this is King. And they're gonna be hunting with us this trip? Yes. And who's all here with us? You got mom. Dad. Dad. Jim Breck, Jasper, 
Thank you. And Miss Jen is cooking for us. All right, let's go find some big box. Get them, boys. You need help? Oh, there you go, buddy. Okay, you did great. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. If that doesn't melt your heart, you might want to check your pulse. In the next scene, Jim Brett Glass is a beautiful management buck. That's what Kinley's here to take. We get her set up. Here we go. Awesome. Good shoot. Great shot. That's a Thank pretty you. buck, Ken. Read and listen. Great shot. Look at that. Dude, that's a pretty nice man. That's super pretty. Got a hell of a frame on it. Kenley, that's starting to talk. Yeah, good shot. <laughs> that was a great shot. Laying down and all. How's that for a shoulder shot? Congratulations on your uh, first mule deer buck. Super proud of you. All your super hard practice of uh, shooting. It paid off and you made an awesome shot right there. My name is Kayla Curtis. Awesome. The evening wrapped up with us sitting on top of the ridge, shuffling through the memories of the day as the sun set around us. Man, I love West Texas. <laughs> Kenley, it's day three. We're gonna get it done today for mom? Yes. Show me with your hands how big a buck she's going to shoot. Half yards? Mm -hmm. Yep. On day three, we head over to an adjacent ranch that's nestled into some really rough country. Both Jim Breck and Jasper told us that these deer are extremely spooky, so we're going to be looking from a long ways off. Once we decide what deer is what, then we'll get as close as we can, but plan on taking a long shot. Just don't get it. You get, you win that in the claw machine? I do. Looking over a pile of deer, there is one clear shooter in the group. Holly sets up for the shot, and the rest is in the history books. Seven hundred yards. yards. What are you getting? You're getting slacky. <laughs> Stone cold. Killer. Stone cold killer. Still got it. <laughs> I'm on the smoke. Yep. Holly got over, recovered that deer, we took some beautiful trophy shots, then gathered him up. We had a huge day in front of us. We were going to head back to the house, get a quick bite to eat, and then she was off chasing an audit. And he didn't. Here you go. Is this Nutella or Old Tella? Your fingers are clean. <laughs> <laughs> Killed a big buck this morning? Yes, hopefully Jasper can get me on a good one. We'll see. We'll see. He's the best talent in the business when it comes to all that. The only thing sandwiched between us is that he's not here. I don't know. What's up? <laughs> Where What's is up? he? We'll be giving him grief the second he walks back yeah. in. Yeah. Go big or go home. That's right. Hey, let's go kill a big one. About like that? <laughs> Just like that. Just like that. A wee bit bigger. Oh, boy. Oh, a, little, a little bit? <laughs> In less than an hour, Jasper had us on a huge group of Audad. For 15 minutes, I filmed every sheep in the bunch. And when it was finally go time, that big ram walked out of my line of sight and Holly smoked him. Oh, you hit him perfect. Stay put. <laughs> 
That sheep died off the end of the bluff, so we gathered up all of our stuff and hiked off to him. Hell yeah, Miss Holly. <laughs> I think. Hell yeah, big old ram. Is that how we do it, Jasper Klein? That's how we do High it. High West Outfitters. Check him out. He is so cool. He's all fused up between his horns. Long, heavy, huge chaps. Hey, Caleb, you jelly? a boy, Jasper. Thanks. Big old chips. I'm gonna throw in between his head there. There's no yeah, hair. Yeah, that's all awesome. Fused up. Man, things happened fast from that point forward. On our last day, we wake up bright and early, we head over to where we had seen our target deer, and as we were watching these deer, off to the left-hand side of us, we saw another group of deer, and we could see big frame, multi-pointed, Caleb laid down, and we we're about to put the hammer down on a beautiful West Texas buck. Are you on him? Just come out from behind a boulder? There you go. Huh? Oh, yeah, Caleb. Deer down. That's my main squeeze. Heck yeah. Putting food on that table. Hell yeah. Got her down. Big buck. Yeah. <laughs> Instant change of plans. That That's was right. fun. Recalculating. Yeah. <laughs> hey, go get him. Put him up. Put him up. You gotta go get him. It wasn't a cold buck. Big buck. Even the dogs are tough. That's a badass buck. That's a big brown buck. He's so heavy right now. That's for sure. Full body or shoulder? <laughs> All of them shoulder. How are we gonna know who's is who's? <laughs> we'll be able to tell. Yeah. We've uh, had a successful few days out here in West Texas. Had an awesome time with uh, Jim Brett, Jasper, Ryan, and the family, and uh, couldn't be happier. We had a great time down here in West Texas. Special thanks to High West Outfitters. It was super fun. Awesome. And I can't wait to come back. Heck yeah. I probably say it way too often. However. There are certain things in life you cannot put a value on. Things like hunting with family and friends. Success on a hunt is your seven-year-old playing with puppies while you watch. Waking up early, hiking in the cold, telling silly jokes, and great big smiles. Filling tags is great, but the value is in the time together. If you would, please remove your hat. I'd like to close in prayer. Lord, thank you for the fall season. Thank you for West Texas and our good friends at High West Outfitters. Thank you for the memories made in hunt camp. And Lord, thank you for keeping us safe and imprinting the desire to return year after year. And it's in your name we pray. Amen.